Hey everybody, Keith K here with another Stranded Deep tutorial. And today we are going to be looking at the last of our um, crafting stations, and that's the brick station. You do need three of these clay uh, and three plank scraps. If uh, you don't have plank scraps, you can make those at the plank station. Um, I've done another tutorial on that, um, which I'll link here. If you're interested, um, you just need wood logs and your plank station and you can make plank scraps. Uh, the other thing you are going to want to have made already is the furnace. And I also have a mini tutorial on that, um, which I'll link. Uh, but it's pretty straightforward. Once you have um, all these resources here, you just go to your crafting menu uh, under your structures. Choose your brick station. And then the thing that you want to make sure you do, um, and I've made this mistake before, is put your brick station, uh, you know, if, if you prefer behind, if you don't want to see it, or in front, but put it close to your furnace. Okay, and I'll show you why. When the, the main thing, that, or really the only thing the brick station is used for, and that's under the tools uh, menu, although it's not a tool, it's a resource you need a brick station and a furnace. And if they're not close enough together, um, they won't both activate and you won't be able to craft any of the brick scraps. So let me grab some clay. Okay, so you need two clay per brick scrap. And then much like, you know, the, these other crafting stations, you just need to stand near it. Um, this is the only one where you need to be near two. So you need to be near the furnace and the brick station, which again is why it's very important you put them close to each other. And then you can craft your brick scrap, which as it says, can be used for crafting a building. And the main uh, use of this is in building for all of the brick uh, items under building. So, you know, you need, you need a good source of clay because you'll make quite a bit of these uh, to make something of significant size, but that's pretty much how you do it. Uh, and that's gonna do, do it for this tutorial. If you uh, enjoyed these, please do like and subscribe. Uh, it really does help the channel. I appreciate everybody's support uh, um, so far and uh, we'll see you back here again soon. Thank you.